Hi, this is Rachel Rehart from Pure Photoshop Actions and I wanted to quickly walk through what you can do if you have something disappear in Lightroom because this can happen a lot. Um, we get emails about this all the time and I figured rather than walking through all of uh, the things via type when we get them in emails uh, or messages, um, I would just make a quick video. So I just wanted to show you quickly how you can return things to your palette. Often this I find that people lose their basic palette. That's the first one, maybe because that's one we use so much. And so people uh, immediately say, oh my gosh, I noticed that it's missing. So I want to show, so this basic panel is not missing. I'll show you how I will make it missing, and then I'll show you how I can bring it back. So as you see, I just right clicked on this term basic. You can also right click on tone curve or any of these on this side, and it will bring up this little box. Now if I unclick this, I no longer have the basic panel. It's gone. So I just need to make sure that I click on one of those headings and bring it back. The same thing can happen over here. Again, people I don't think always notice that it's missing, but I can come over here and I can um, click on presets and I could get rid of collections. Maybe I don't use collections very much and I want to get rid of it. I can clean things up, but if I suddenly decide I want to use collections more often, I can bring it back and now I have collections. So uh, that's one thing. You can also say I never use slideshow and I want to I want to get this all tidied up because I actually really don't ever use slideshow. I can go over here and say well I never use map and I never use slideshow and really I don't ever use book either and I could really tidy this up. Um, that's you know that's great. You can totally do that. Or if you decide you do want to use those again, you can bring them back at any time by clicking on that. You can also quickly hide whole panels like this. Uh, using these little arrows, I can hide all sorts of things. Um, it makes it quite simple. You can also use um, uh, it over on this side as well. Sorry. Um, so those are kind of the most common accidental losing of different tools and different things that you can do. So uh, I wanted to just show that to you so that you have those options to fix uh, should the need arise. Anyway, thank you so much. This is Rachel Rehart from Pure Photoshop Actions.